German health authorities are busy working to contain this latest strand of the coronavirus. On Monday, a 33-year-old man from Starnberg, just south of Munich, caught the virus from a woman during a work training session. The woman had traveled from China to take part and on her return home was taken ill. It's one of the few known cases of human-to-human -human transmission. The patient is doing well. However, he is still isolated at the Schwabing Clinic in Munich, where he is under medical supervision. The contact person's investigation is running at full speed, particularly in the family environment and in the company surroundings who have already been informed. It's now widely thought an infected individual can transmit the disease for up to two weeks before symptoms even appear. There have now been three more cases in Bavaria, it's thought connected to the initial one, while 40 other people are undergoing checks by health officials. Despite this, visitors to the Munich clinic are calm. I had an appointment there. They have an isolation station and I feel very safe. But the Bavarian government has played it down. They haven't done enough. I would say that health is already a priority here. And in the end, we are looked after. But the spread of the virus is quite high. With these Bavarian cases, possibly the first known human-to-human -human transmission in Europe, measures are in place at the country's airports to try to limit further contamination. First of all, I'm going to ask pilots to inform the control tower about the health of their passengers when they land on flights from China. We will also require passengers to fill out forms so that we can contact them within the next 30 days and find out where they are staying. Lufthansa, Germany's national airline, has canceled all flights to China, yet Munich Airport has not yet implemented mandatory temperature screening of passengers from China adopted by other European airports. We are also discussing further measures with the federal government, for example, where it might be useful to measure fever at airports as well. But there is no final decision yet. Approximately 90 German citizens are currently being evacuated from Wuhan and should be back in the country on Saturday. The European Union has stepped up its response to the outbreak following the confirmed cases here in Germany. Two aircrafts have been made available to repatriate any EU citizens that wish to return from the Wuhan area. 250 French nationals as well as 100 other EU nationals are expected back on two aircrafts over the next few days. Natalie Carney for CGTN in Munich, Germany.